Hey, it's Bob Express Restoration. We're out here on site with Calvary Restoration with Chris Peebles and his crew. He came up to Oklahoma City from Florida to help me out with some jobs. We had uh, freezing pipes and stuff. This is a very complex construction job. It had a fire previously and it had multiple sprinkler heads that ruptured. This is Chris Peebles. Hey, how's it going, guys? Calvary Restoration here. Uh, Bob and I have been friends for a long time. I actually worked for Bob years ago, kind of showed me the industry, showed me the business. I went out to Florida, I got a lot of licensing. We followed each other. He's actually helped me out with some crazy stuff going out there. When all this came back and it hit our home base, there was a lot of work out here that not everybody could get to. So I've got a little bit of uh, leeway when it comes to crews and stuff and come out and was able to help some of the customers out for express restoration. But anyway, we're going to do a quick walk through. This is about a 65,000 square foot lot. It's pretty complex, a lot of moving parts. They've already been through, I think, six or seven 40 yard dumpsters, two or three 30 yard dumpsters. The magnitude of this job is huge. Chris has done an outstanding job getting personnel, people here to go through this. I'm going to end up drying the, the property, but uh, he's getting all the demo, treating microband, and checking for uh, mold, checking for asbestos, lead, and all those different things you do on a project like that. He's very outstanding, very professional. But anyway, as you can kind of look around, you can see they demoed, took all the insulation, drywall, they had some sprinkler heads that ruptured, they had carpet down here and pads with a horse pad like they do in some of these uh, commercial losses, I guess the hotels. But anyway, we're going to walk through the property real quick. So you can show this. this. This is all in the floor due to the fire. Most of this was in the floor. Because of the soot, we took out the walls. Got some insulation board and whatnot. Now, right now, we're just cleaning everything up. You can see it goes all the way down through here. Still on? Yeah. Okay. As you can see down there, it's the same thing. It had another sprinkler head. We're going to go downstairs, walk around, and go up under this. Basically, do flood cuts or total guts. Every job's a little different, so you piece through together. So uh, this is just one phase of many that they're gonna go through, getting this prepped and dry and do the rebuild. But anyway, we'll go downstairs real quick. Most of this is, uh, we moisture map all this before we come in and actually cut everything out. Ceiling tiles dropped it down to so kind of some skeleton inside of the uh, truss and the floor up there. And we're going to put that into the bar area. Get to here. Here you go. They kind of came in and they had gutted everything you can see. Go around and look at everything. This area is really saturated. We had so much contents in this room, guys. There's a lot of stored. Um, Carpet. carpet pad and carpet and all sorts of other things that were in here that were just holding the moisture in. We This is a full gut uh, bar none because not only was the fire, there was also so much water that we had to get everything behind the wall. Yeah. Anyway, this is Bob with Express Restoration. You reach me at Airco 405-922-8891 for uh, water mitigation. If you have something at this scale, we have plenty of labor and plenty of other companies here that can assist us. You can reach Chris at 850-900. 6500 CRC, water fire, water mold. Thank you, everybody. Everybody have a great day, and I hope you enjoyed the video.